Hello, by Charles Hoyfort, Part 1, Chapter 15L. Whether the police forced this mystery to a pseudo-conclusion or not, a suggestive instance is told of in the London Daily Express, October 16, 1906. A young woman had been arrested in Paris, charged with picking pockets, and to all inquiries she answered in an unknown language. Interpreters tried her with European and Asiatic languages without success, and the magistrate ordered her to be kept under surveillance in a prison infirmary. Almost immediately, watchers reported that she had done exactly what they wanted to report that she had done, that she had talked in her sleep, not mumbling in any way that might be questionable, but speaking up in fluent French, with the true Parisian accent. If anybody thinks that this book is an attack upon scientists, as a distinct order of beings, he has a more special idea of it than I have. As I'm seeing things, everybody's a scientist.